to Acts of Mina. If I hear for the first time, don't forget to click on that button and subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to click on the bell and then anytime I upload a new video, it's going to notify you. So this today we're making a fascinating heart with feathers and brush. And before we get started, let me show you the material that we need for this. We're gonna need this, which is very important. And so our feathers, we're gonna need our feathers. This is a yard, but I'm not using everything. This is a yard. Then we're going to need our can you see our brain this is flower brain you can see we're going to need it we're going to need our needle and thread okay, so we can we're going to need these our alice paint you can you see we're going to need our gum use your gum of your choice then our needle and thread so we're going to need our net you can you see i don't know what you call it all my nets can you see we're going to need our smoother net the next thing we're going to need our stream streaming can you see can you see so the first thing we're going to do is can you see i've already tied this at the top this is too yard i've already tied make sure when you're using yours you know this is color black don't make sure that you, you make sure you use Try that it's color black, don't use white so that you're going to make your work very neat. You can see that I'm using black to match it, so I'm going to tie then you cut it out. So the next thing I'm going to do now, I'm going to do running stitches. Can you see? Let's start from up. Up. Okay, you see what I'm doing. Down. Don't forget that, I'm, that this is too yard. This is too yard. I don't think I'm going to use everything finished. Everything on here once it's very thick. You can see what I'm doing. Hence what I have left. Hence what I have left. Then you tie. Get a seam to tie it. Tie it very well. Make sure you tie it very well. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. Make sure I tie it very well. And I cut this out. Sorry for that. You guys are seeing what I'm doing. Can you see? Can you see? Now, I'm about to tie it. I'm going to tie it. So I'm going to put this one down. I'm going to put this down. Then you tuck it. Make sure you tuck it very well. Take your time to tuck it very well. Tuck it very well. So see what I'm doing. Tuck it. That's why I'm tucking this. So the next thing you're going to do is the Alice band. I like working with rubber. I like to throw it at Alice. Okay. Can you see this band? Because you're seeing this is up and this is down. This is whatever you want it to be. 
Is it that you want to fish that with these? So you tack it. You tack it. That's all I'm doing. Tacking it. Tacking it. Tuck it. Until you tuck it. I'm tying it now. Can you see? So the next thing now, you're going to cut your streaming cuts. Can you see? Let's go. Let me use up. Shoot. Two inches, cut it out, and you apply it on the side. I used to cover the thread. I don't know what it's not coming out. Apply it on to it. Apply it on to it. And set that aside, make it dry a bit to set it aside. But the next thing now is our feathers. Like I said, I said I have more inches here. I'm folding to two, I'm folding to four. So I'm going to use. Can you see this is four? I'm going to cut one of the bits out. Okay. 